Hey everyone, this is Jason with DragonsTech.com, and today we're going to be having a brief discussion on stable coins and counterparty risk. I'm going to link the full article that I wrote on DragonsTech.com in the description below, and also an Investopedia um, article. So, the reason why I bring it up is because there's been recent news that USDT has fallen below a dollar, and the whole point of stable coins is that they're supposed to be backed by uh, USD, which in essence would mean that they don't fall below a dollar, they can because each USDT is attached to one dollar. So the question becomes what's going on? Now how this relates to counterparty risk is counterparty risk is basically the risk that's involved with taking a contract with an organization that tells you that their currency is backed by some real world asset or currency like gold or the US dollar but it really isn't or even if it were would it be as much as they claim to have so I'm going to link that in the description below I want you to check it out and then comment below so that we can keep the discussion going I mean this could determine the future of stable coins so check it out and I'll talk to you later